20 seconds in Thailand, Thailand Rob. Only one person knows what's different about this image, but can you tell the difference? Yes, I decided to change just a little bit of something today for the picture. If you can notice any difference, please in the comments, let me know what you think I did. And then of course, I'm gonna write and tell you what exactly it was that I did. Yes, I'm gonna make a normal video. Yes, I'm gonna make a normal video. All right, so did you notice anything different? Let me know what you think in the little Let me know what you think in the comments and I'll tell you if you're right. Thanks guys, bye. All right, so I walk back down to the beach and I come to this little corner, which is my new little corner like I had in Bangkok. Because right here at the at the pavilion, they have um, they have they have wine, food, coffee, cake and Wi-Fi. W what else do I need? What else? <laughs> but every time I'm here, I always have to look up because they still have the coconuts up here. You don't want to sit under, mm -mm, you don't want to sit under one of these trees. Oh, man, I just got stung by a bee. Oh, it right now. Oh, I really hope I'm not allergic to Thailand bees. Oh. Sorry, I'm gonna be distracted now. Uh, I need tobacco. I need tobacco. Anyway, uh, freaking stingers. So again, let me say if yes, if the picture looks better on the first half of the uh, first half, if the picture looks better in the beginning of this than now, please let me know what you see differently. Please give me all the feedback in the comments. I am really looking forward to to the comments to see on your device whether it was your laptop or your uh tablet or your phone what if there was any visual difference from that to this i'm such a little whiny person when it comes to being hurt oh, now it's itching one little topic that i did want to talk about today that i spoke about about eight weeks ago i think about two months ago i made a topic and the topic was uh thai women thai women and um jealousy Oh, no, that wasn't it. Oh, Thai women and trust. And when I made the video, what was happening at the time was uh, someone I know was going through a breakup. Someone else I know was having some arguments. And then there was another person that was going through the same thing. And they all had the same story that they said they were having so much trouble dealing with their girlfriend. Now, when I made the video, I made the video just to say, dang, you know, I, I got three friends that are having trouble with their girlfriends. Okay, so since that time that I made that video, what has happened is one couple has actually dissolved. They have they've decided to split up amicably. Uh, he went his way, she went her way, and pretty much they're fine. The other two couples, uh, they're still together, they're fine. They still have their moments, but, oh, it's hot here today. It's like 29. But there's a piece of information that I've learned since that video that I did not know when I made that video to make the Thai women look better than I did in that video. I was not, I was not trying to stereotype every Thai woman. This is not the case. And I've said this over and over again, and I know I'll still get some comments I'm stereotyping. I am not stereotyping. These are specific situations and specific events with specific people. However, what I have learned, when you first come to Thailand, if you get into a relationship and you're in this relationship and the woman appears to be clingy, 
or doesn't want you to be alone or doesn't want you to go out. The first thing that you might think of is, oh, she's clingy, she's uh, wanting to control me, uh, et cetera, et cetera, and, and you get smothered. You could, you could actually feel smothered. That was what the first thought I had was when these guys were telling me about this. However, what I have come to realize clearly, please listen to this. This is a helpful tip for anybody with a beast thing. The Thai women and I have talked, we have talked and I have watched other people talk about it. What the main thing is, it's not jealousy of the guy going out and being a dirt bag. Although yes, in some cases it is, it is pure just jealousy. But in this specific topic of what I'm talking about with these specific incidents is what the Thai women are worried about is other Thai women. If they see a nice looking man walking down the road, Thai women are e easy, Thai women will easily approach you and say hello. I said that in one of my other videos. They are looking for a relationship. It's not like in America where you have to go to the woman and basically plead to say hello to her. No, over here, they'll say hello to you first. So if a Thai woman gets with her new boyfriend, Frank, and she's happy, and he says, oh, I'm gonna go to the store and grab a jug of milk or something like that, she's like, I'll go right with you. Because what she's thinking is, you're not gonna go to the store and pick up a girlfriend, but if you go to the store, there's gonna be probably a few women that are gonna be like, hey. In the two relationships that are still together, what they have done to, to work it out is conversation. It's conversation. One, there's an English, uh, excuse me, not English. One, there was a language barrier. So they're working on the language barrier so they can, they can fix that. The other one, it's just kind of like um, someone that's been, uh, the Thai woman who has been hurt many times before and she's just she's just trying to protect herself from being hurt again uh, I, again many of you have had same or different relationships and I know you're gonna put in the comments that I'm either right or wrong but I can tell you for the three couples that I've met I am absolutely right I know these people personally yeah I'm getting old I have to use reading glasses now my eyes don't work anymore so I just wanted to kind of do an update on that um, the one couple that split up, they'd been together a while, and I can tell you from what I physically saw that it, it was it had gone south a while back, and it was probably just the best thing that they split up. The other two couples, they're fine. One of them is so, they're so good together. It's, it's amazing. In these relationships, uh, some of the Thai women work, and some of the Thai women don't work. That's a whole nother big deal. Can you support your Thai woman? Or does your Thai woman already support herself? Either way, there's gonna be some type of support needed over here. There's no way in this video right here I can convey this. If you have been to Thailand, you understand women and the money. And I'm not talking about prostitution. I am talking about the culture of Thailand. Until you are submerged in it here, you don't understand it it's very 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 difficult to understand that almost everything with the relationship there is a there is a monetary essence to it um, again I'm not going to go into that on this video I actually don't have the 100% expertise to even go into that you can watch some of the other channels that have been here for uh, uh, 20 years however long they've been here they give good advice or I think they I think they give good advice so that's it I'm wrapping this up is a quick quick little day it's hot as mess out here and I just want to go take a shower and get this video up I've been working on the website all day I am NOT a web designer so this has just been a freak out mode for me to try to figure out how to do this oh I forgot to tell you guys that oh, the websites up uh, 20 seconds in Thailand.com or thailandrob.com um, go check it out it's it's in the baby stages sorry I don't even have much up there but I will um, yeah I will and then and then and then no and then no and then no and then no and then and then no no and then no and then start piss me off lady and then
Then and then and then. Can you take this asshole back to America, please? Oh, very good. Don't forget that. <laughs>